Okay, Tuesday morning in the kingdom, and it's going to be Tuesday, Tuesday. Yes, Tuesday, Tuesday. Nothing's going to change. It's just going to be a normal day here. It's the last of our warm days, and then it's going to turn chilly here. All right, we woke up to minus 6 Celsius. Yes, it's warm, but feels like minus 11, but it's warm. Then on the yo-yo scale, plus 21 Fahrenheit. See, I told you it's warm, but feels like plus 12. Okay. I'm not sure how that's even warmer, warm, and warmest. We're going to have to watch Sesame Street to figure it out. Yesterday was a good day. And we celebrated. Look at that. Ooh. This was imported from the far south because we can't buy this locally. Yes, it was delicious. Yes, it was a change from the vodka and the Jack Daniels. So that's what I mean. People arriving in the kingdom for a visit... They bring southern gifts. Yes, tasty ones too. All right, so the flags are untangled. They're in their natural state of being limp. There's no sunshine, but today we have to have a full production day to get the last of the diesel cats changed out on the thermostat. So we have Aggie plugged in right there, and the snow is removed off the hood before it melts and gets down in between the sideboards. Yes, the sideboards. So hopefully we can finish up Communist Cat, and then Aggie goes in. So we have to finish out tonight with one of the gas TD6s in the shop thawing out. Because it's going to get chilly tonight, minus 20 Celsius. Ooh. So Aggie right there, and Communist Cat that's in the shop, they have to have the plates removed from their carburetors. Yes, the carburetors on the diesel cat. Then they should start all the same. So all the cats are normal. So we have eight TD6s and TD9s for each, okay? They're in and out of the shop like it's just a revolving door. Like my marriage. Oh, unreal what she did. And we got the wagons lined up there. Oh, the wheelbarrow and the wagon lined up to fill it up with wood. Because we're just feeding the wood stove a nice even temperature. So today should be a good day. Oh, Look at Kijiji there, hooked to the welding sleigh. And then we have the twin free fall hooked to the caboose. So once it gets cold, we can start dragging this mess in the yard. Yes, because if we drag it now, it's pointless. Oh, look at those skies. It might snow today too. Even better. Oh, uh oh, the Mephone's changing colors. Darkness, lightness. So that means I'm censored. Well, I better end this intro before the boss comes. He's such an asshole. Okay, today we're hoping for a good production day, but the me phone has already started off by censoring me in the morning intro. It's norm outside, and for some reason it's recorded in mono. on freaking real. So we got the wood here, and yes, this is firewood. We save everything and burn everything. Oh, look at the water bottles. Back in the summer when we could afford water bottles up here, the staff was drinking them. But that was also clogging up our coffee maker because water in water bottles is not pure. Okay, so over here... This morning when we filled up the wheelbarrows in the wagon, we brought the cover plywood off the tote, wood tote, because this thing was heavy. Yes, it was heavy for an old guy my age. It was covered in snow and ice, ice mainly. So there was about three, quarter of a, three quarters of an inch of ice on it, and it was heavy. So now I've thawed it out. Now I can take it back outside and put it on the wood tote before it starts snowing. All right, let's get this... Uh, TD6 known as Communist Cat in and out. He has two items, thermostat, and remove the plate in the carburetor. All right, let's hope for a good production day. If not, we'll have to day drink. Okay, lunchtime in the kingdom, and we did it. We did this cat. We changed the thermostat out, and we removed the block-off plate on the carburetor. So with all the cats will be normal with the plates removed. Then they should all start the same in theory. Yes. All right, so only three more cats to do. I don't know if we're going to get it done today. Hopefully we can, but it's only three. Th three cats, three thermostats. Let's see, how many beers will that be?
Okay, three o'clock coffee in the kingdom and Aggie is done. I have to think of these ones. They all look the same. So I could be photoshopping or pulling your guys' legs, but no, nope. there we go. Two carburetor plugs and that one came out of Aggie. So now all the carburetors have no block off plates. They're straight flow through carburetors for the diesel motor. Okay, let's grab a quick coffee, get, get Aggie out and bring in the curse of reverse. So that means only two more thermostats to go. If I stay sober, I might be able to get it done today. Okay, here's proof in the pudding that there's only two more left to go. Yes, two more, and then I'll be done. So we started on Saturday cutting out the gaskets and hopefully finish by Tuesday. So that works out pretty good. Tuesday morning in Whoville and it's just after 8.30 a.m. and I'm getting ready to head to work now. As you can see, there is no sunrise this morning. It's hidden behind all the clouds and stuff. It is pretty warm out as well, so I'm sure it will snow. Now let's let the dogs back in and get to work. 12.30 and I just finished having lunch. I just had soup and a sandwich for lunch and now it's time to head back to work. It is snowing as you can see and it's been like that all morning actually. Now let's let the dogs in and get going. <laughs> Just after 4 p.m. and I made it home from work. I also stopped at the post office and looks like we have a box. There's a couple envelopes. I will open those when I get to the kingdom. Also have my dad's laundry there as well. Now it's time to get the skiddy wheel and head on over. Sure is getting nasty out here as you can see. So I bet you by this evening it'll be snowing even more. 4.30 and I just made it to the kingdom. This is one of the boxes I picked up at the mail today. Thank you so much, Rex A. I'm just about to open it now and see what's inside. And as you can see that it was opened. I'm not sure what they did to the inside, but I will see. And I don't know why it was opened either. They don't leave us a note or tell us what was wrong. So I guess we'll find out when we open the box. And I also have two letters here, so I will open those as well. Just opened up the box and this is what was inside. Thank you so much Rex A. This is greatly appreciated. Was not expecting this at all. The dogs are going to be happy there and I even got some hot chocolate. My dad likes his coffee. Wow. Thank you so much Rex A. We are for sure going to have to send you something. Wow. Look at all this. Even got some more Kool-Aid that my dad likes. But this is amazing. Thank you so much. Now it's time to head down to the shop and see what my dad is up to. I'm pretty sure I'm just shoveling off one of the deck sleighs. That way we can use it as a test sleigh in the bush on the trails. That way if we take the caboose down, we know if we're going to whack down a couple of trees or get hung up on something. So it's better to do a test trial first than to take all the cabooses and stuff down and then find out we can't get through the bush. Down at the wood pile and the loading ramp, my dad asked me to shovel off the deck sleigh here. It doesn't look like too much snow and most of it is pretty fluffy so it shouldn't take me very long. That way when we're ready we can hook up to this sleigh and take it through the bush as a test trial. Got the deck sleigh cleared off and it's ready to go. But with all this snow coming down I might have to shovel it off again. Now it's time to head back up to the shop and see what my dad's up to.
5 o'clock and I just switched over to my dad's knee phone. We are taking Aggie around to hook up to one of the other cats and we can drag it into the shop. It is having problems with the starter so my dad's going to put it in the shop and see what's wrong. Plus he has to change the thermostat on it. So now I'll go meet him up beside the house and video that. got the cat up to the shop now my dad's gonna wiggle it around and straighten it up so we can open the shop doors and push it in not sure if you can count here but we have one two three four five six cats that are all from the 1940s sitting here and they all run this one does run as well it's just having some issues but that is pretty amazing having all these cats running Just got the cat switched out my dad put communist cat back in front of the shop here in case we need it i also closed up the doors here and put the tarps under my dad can close it up from the inside he just went to go park aggie up by the house where we can plug it in not sure what we're doing now but i guess i'll find out 
back in the house and I'm going to divide up some of the snacks that we just got. We're going to get a care package ready for Johnny's grandkids and himself. Of course, we still have a few things to add so we won't give it to him right away, but I'm going to go through this and pick out some good stuff for him. Just after 5.30 and I'm officially done in the kingdom, I put some stuff aside for Johnny. We won't give it to him just yet because we have a few more things to add into there for his grandkids, but I hope he does like it. Now it's time to head on back into Whoville and do the weather. Almost 6 o'clock and I just made it back from the kingdom. I already put the skidoo away. I forgot to mention in the last video that box I opened from Rex A. Nothing was missing inside there. Everything was there and accounted for and nothing was damaged. So I'm not sure why they opened it, but I'm glad that they at least put a piece of tape on it. Now it's time to head inside, let the dogs out and do the weather. Quarter after 6 and this is the temperature we're sitting at today. It's negative 11 degrees Celsius, which is 12 degrees Fahrenheit. We even have the feels like on the bottom. I'm not sure if this is right. My weather network would not load, so I'm just going off the weather that I seen in the kingdom when I was last there. But as you can see, it's snowing pretty good. I'm going to wipe off my little railing here so when I wake up in the morning, I can see how much snow has come down. Now it's time to head inside, make supper, and end my day. Okay, 7 o'clock and we officially did it. Yes, 7, 8, no, 8 thermostats all installed on the small TD9s and the TD6s. All right, so over here, oh, we got the starter to quit. It kind of upsets me because I bought starters back in 2017. I think it was 1000 bucks a pop. And here we are using junkers, eh? That we scab together one more time. All right, so over here, oh yeah, we got to walk by the promo bike and smile. Yes. All right, so Laverne got, no, this is Curse of the Reverse, and the starter malfunctioned, okay. It was tougher changing the thermostat on this cat because everything was cold. All the other ones have been coming in with the motor running and warm. It made it a lot nicer, but this thing was stone cold, so that's kind of boring, but no problem. Just pop off the intake pipe pop out the starter change it out so that's worked out pretty well very pleased all right let's run this cat outside and bring in communist cat because he was having uh, injector issues he was kind of running fully full retard sitting outside so i think we have to set the timing on the injection pump all right let's get out of here Okay, 7.30 and the cats are changed out. Yes, so the communist cat can warm up overnight and think about why he was acting up today. All right, so it's kind of nasty out here. The wind got up, the snow is here, and the temperature's chilling off. All right, let's go walk the dogs, make a video, drink some beer, and we'll talk to you later.